Anyway, so we're at the world box. It's very cool. Um, it's some god game where you can play as like random people and they will make a kingdom or something. Oh, we have Russia. Okay. So um I I think you guys know the concept. It's just you're a god and you can do it whatever you want. Alright, let me begin with placing down some random people like America maybe. Alright, I've gave everyone some more people and everyone is just expanding. I um, added all the nations now. You see there's some, some more nations in Asia. Um, because no one wants to spawn on Europe or something or East America. Also, we got a new nation here. Let's just call this, you know, what, what do we call this? Siberia. Okay. Um... Russia is not doing so well. They don't have a lot of people. And surprisingly, Saudi Arabia is doing very well. They have a lot of people. Um, but not a lot of land to expand because they're like a bit locked between Asia and uh, Europe and Africa. Alright, so as you go further in the time, you see like India and, and China become like very large. Um, and Saudi Arabia is just really locked in the space they have and like brazil and america have a lot of land to expand here and the usa has made a new city it's uh Usdrin. i believe it's just alaska but very nice All right so congo has like rapidly expanded their uh city here it's nine people but they locked russia off so russia can't get any more land i believe but i think they can go overseas or something and the same moment I was looking here, there's three wars now. Planning war from Russia against Finland and Spain against Saudi Arabia and India against China. So it will be some interesting things. And Australia is going to form an alliance with China. So Australia might, might help India if they are quick enough. So right. And uh, Brazil and the United States have formed an alliance. That's some interesting news. And Spain is, I think, going to war. Oh, India is going to war with China. Let's see what's going to happen. There they go. Oh, all attacking. Fire starts. Damn. And Russia declared war on Finland here. And Spain is going to war with Saudi Arabia. They are fighting the Libyan desert. So it looks like Spain is winning this war because they are losing a lot of men. Oh, Siberia declared war in China. Now China is getting attacked from all sides. And I think they're gonna fall. Yep. India took China over. Now India is gonna be the world power here. Oh, a lot of things happened. Oh, Russia took Finland. Finland is destroyed. And Saudi Arabia is probably getting killed. Are they still at war yet? Yep. Spain is getting a lot of land here. Alright, so Australia joined the Supreme Power Alliance and Congo declared war on Spain. So let's see what's gonna happen. Where is Congo's army? Oh, hey guys, stop farming. Got to go to war. Alright, let me slow down the time a bit. So they're invading in here and Australia is also sending a lot of troops here. I believe that, yep, uh, the Saudi Arabia province died. And... Spain is getting like beaten up so hard. Oh, what's their army gonna do? Oh, they're gonna retreat. Alright, so Australia's army arrived to attack Spain, I believe. So now Australia is gonna help Congo attacking. But Congo is very strong, so they probably can take out Spain. Yep, they're gonna take out Spain. Yep, and there goes Spain. And the Supreme Power Alliance is like very strong. It's stronger than uh, the United States and Russia combined. So this is some good alliance maybe. Alright, so Siberia and India are plotting a war. And Siberia declared war in India. Um, Maybe Congo or Australia will involve. So. Alright, so there goes the army of Siberia. Oh, wait. They're attacking the other army. Oh, and the army of India died. So Siberia will occupy the China province. And maybe they can attack further. 
All right, so India is taking back the China province from Siberia again. And now they're like, yeah, now it's Siberia was, who was going to fall because India's army is going to march here. Oh, Congo declared war on Russia. Oh, let me see this. Oh, and it took Saudi Arabia. And Congo got occupied and losing the Spain province. And now Russia is really strong. If 200 population. Army is... Oh, the king of Russia died. And Congo now occupied this again. Oh. Will Russia win this? I believe they will because they have like more men. Oh, I'm just looking at Siberia. Take the China province again, but they lost. Oh, and Siberia is taking China province again. India has like no army anymore. Okay, they're gonna push. And Congo took the Finland province here. Yo. And the Russian capital just got obliterated by the Congo army. And they're now fighting at the Bosporus. But I believe there's a Russian army. Yeah, it's here. It's fighting with someone. And Congo is taking back their land like really, really rapidly. Now Russia is getting like less troops. They only have one army here. Congo with 4 and the 5th army of the Australians will attack. So now 3 armies are advancing. And Australia is capturing the Congo province again. And I believe this is the end of Russia. Yep, this is the end of Russia. Oh, the Great Shield. So India and uh, Siberia became friends. Alright, so Congo started the war on India. And now Siberia will join in, but Australia will also join in. So it's going to be an alliance conflict. Let's see how it's going to turn out. And now Australia is also pushing. And Congo is losing the Russia province, but they're pushing back. Let me slow the time a bit. Let me slow it. So there's like multiple armies here. One, two, three, four, five. And then six. And there's another army of the Siberians. And India... Oh, this is the this is the end of India. Alliance Great Shield was dissolved. Right, so the world is now divided into two: our accord and the supreme power. So, what I'm gonna do? I'm just gonna let them declare war, and then let's see who is gonna be the winner. Well, I don't need to declare war because, like, Congo is plotting again. I'll just wait. Siberia died. Yep, it died. Alright, so Greenland is getting attacked and it got invaded by the uh, Americans. And now Congo is moving their troops. But they're not really moving their troops, it's just sitting. Congo is just invading because um, they have like all their armies here. And America's fighting a war here. Oh, and Brazil died. And USA is getting occupied. Well, even if I didn't build these bridges, they will just make uh, boats and then occupy the USA so now Congo is attacking here and they're moving all their armies to the USA to the last part well let's just totally end it but then up all war the inevitable death of Australia and Congo became a superpower in this world all right that was it for today then uh, I hope you liked the video uh, if you did, please give a like and subscribe for all these Congo soldiers that fought in the wars and won. Um, if you want to watch more World Box, then just tell me. Because I bought the game for new and I don't know what to do with it. So uh, I'm just uh, gonna make some random videos again. And I will see you guys next time. See ya.